any rational fears in your life? Well, I think mine's rational. Choking. I think choking is a rational fear, isn't it? Well, isn't it? I mean, may maybe not. Well, are you scared of choking all the time? Not all the time. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know something? I'm gonna, I'm gonna open up to you, because this is a bit like therapy, and oh, I've yeah. had two gin and tonics. <laughs> <laughs> every, time, every time I have an avocado, every time I cut through an avocado, and I see the stone, I, I envisage that stone <laughs> being lodged in my windpipe. And, I, and every time, I think I physically go, mmm. <laughs> I That's, can't stand it. Is that quite debilitating? No, I just don't have that much avocado. <laughs> <laughs> I do it all the time. No, I've got a real thing, though. I've got a real thing about choking. I mean, if you're on your own, if you're in a hotel, you know, if you're just... It could take days to find you. <laughs> well, if you're choked to death. Well, I guess what, has it happened to you? Yes, I've choked to death many times. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? No wonder you're scared of it. Yeah. <laughs> no, it has. It has happened. Oh, you have choked. On it food. It yeah, and it's scary. It's a horrible. Did somebody? Did somebody dislodge it? One time they did actually. It was I, I did that show. Never mind the buzzcocks. And oh, one yeah. time I'd had too many of these crisps. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm a pig, and I like eating crisps as quickly as possible. So I hoovered these crisps down, and they weren't ready to go down, <laughs> and they got lodged. And so I had a beer in my hand, and I was like doing that, and people going. <laughs> And um, so I had this beer, it sort of all came out. And for, thank God, someone, a, a, an actor called Andy Smart, who I'd known for years, got behind me and did the Heimlich manoeuvre. And I was very, very grateful. Because, as I understand it, if you can still breathe or mm -hmm. talk, then it's, it's, in the, it's in the safe pipe. Or cough. or Yes, yes. yeah, then you're not going to die. But it, it feels very scary when you've got something lodged in your throat. That's happened to me a few times. Last time it happened to me was at Andy Circus's house. Wait a minute, that's happened to you a few times? Yeah! Because I still haven't learned. Stop wolfing food down! But, Graham, it's fucking crisps. <laughs> what do you want me to do? I'm not going to chew that shit. I have to devour crisps. What, what's, a, what's a crisp? Is it like a, a donut? Potato chips. Oh, oh. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Potato, potato chips. chips, yeah. They're nice, right? It seems unlikely, doesn't it? Yeah. But also, yeah. they're a bit jagged. They're a bit jagged. Ow. Do, do, do you swallow them whole or do you no. chew them? <laughs> You would think not. Yeah, yeah. You would think not. But no, I do definitely chew, but um, you just ate too much. Not enough. Yeah, because yeah, I'm in such a hurry to get that crispy flavour. <laughs> <laughs> to get that <laughs> sort of hit of cholesterol. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I can't wait for your obituary. <laughs> He'd been warned many times. <laughs>